Hey guys, Silence Silenceo here. Welcome back to another episode of Utah Across Gacha videos. Before we begin, let me give you guys a very big grateful thank you so much um, for all the video views recently. Um, I think there's a whole bunch of you who are actually new to the channel. So for those of you who are new, make sure you guys go watch up on all the tutorial videos and all that kind of stuff. But of course, if you can't find the mentions of certain uh, game mechanics that are in Uta Macross um, because some of, sometimes all this information is like spread out throughout all the gacha videos um, so they don't have specific tutorial videos so I do apologize for that but for long time viewers um, of my channel and of course for my translated content for Uta Macross you guys will probably um, have been kept up to date with all the um, game updates and all that kind of stuff so yeah, for those who are new, if you can't find the information, um, please make sure you ask me in the comment section down below. I'll try my best to um, give you information regarding the, the part of the game that you don't understand. So thank you very much for all the views. It has um, helped the channel grow greatly, um, especially for those of you who are also following me on Instagram. Make sure you guys do follow me there. Uh, aside from all the time across stuff, I also do post um, stuff that I've gotten from my week collection <laughs> um, because I haven't really gotten time to do unboxing videos anymore. So that's probably the best way to let you guys know what I've recently got. Um, I would love to go back to doing unboxing videos, but you know, time is kind of uh, tight <laughs> with all my work schedule and of course with things going around me. Um, so yeah, I really appreciate if you guys actually do follow me on Instagram. That's probably the best way to keep up to date with what's going around me. Uh, of course, with all the Macross information as well, aside from Uta Macross. Uh, so yeah. Anyways guys, um, before we dive in, I'm sure most of you who have been playing the game for the last three days or so probably see this um, information being released. Um, because usually during this time period of the, the month, we get a brand new addition to the permanent song list in Uhamai Cross. And this time round, uh, we get... Uh, what's that song? Um, it can, it can I Borderline? Another version. So if you guys are still not clear what another version means, it basically means another chorus um, within the song. So there is the regular Ikenai borderline version which feels like the TV size and of course the, another version is basically uh, another section from the full song for Ikenai borderline that has now been added into Utami Cross gameplay. Um, so yeah, that's pretty nice. So it means that for us free to play players or you know pay to win players, um, it's just another whole batch of resources for Evolving your episode plates uh, and of course, you know, singing stones for your gacha pools in the future. So guys, let's dive into the gacha banner and let's break down Maki Maki's brand new um, Rose Noble costume episode plate. Yeah, so she's pink, so <laughs> that's why Rose, um, although the pink isn't exactly the color of a rose. So let's take a look at the episode plates stats. So 3760 total score that is if you get the episode played to its plus 25 luck value if it's not at its plus 25 luck value for us um, regular players it's gonna be a total score of 3510 which is technically just one point lower than Ray Ray's recent episode played so yeah anyways um, Looking at the rest of the stats, it's focusing a lot on Soul, which is exactly what you need for the current Macross 7 event um, for the Red Boss. And of course, Voice gets a little bit more stats compared to Charm, which suffers greatly. Pay attention to the other 3 Divas that can use Maki Maki's episode plate, especially if you guys want to, you know, build up um, a selection of episode plates for Makina or maybe Kaname, Shero or Basara when the um, Diva Improvement event next month uh, will occur because this month we are getting the high score versus event um, since we already went through the Diva Improvement event last month 
So center skill for the episode plate, soul up units, soul is boosted by 90% up, which is pretty fantastic uh, if you want to have this episode plate as a center position plate, if you don't have a Macross 7, 7 star plate to use, so this can be kind of a replacement. Uh, active skill, life recovery at 30%, so pretty much similar to Ray Ray's episode plate, um, doesn't have the best healing abilities, because 50% is definitely the best, 30% mm, eh, does its job, but not its full potential. Life skill, so this one is pretty interesting, um, my friends, which is the current event song, um, technically you could play the rest of the other event songs. Um, but my friends, which is the main focus one, um, is technically a long duration song. So this episode plate is featuring a short duration ability, uh, which is not exactly ideal for high score purposes, especially since the raid boss event requires a high score to kind of dish out as much damage to the raid boss as possible. So, mm. <laughs> so okay. If you guys are still not familiar with this ability, basically it requires the fold percentage. Of course, 110% is the highest you can um, probably max out for your best high score achievement purpose. Um, so yeah, so for every 1% attained for the fold percentage, you get that 1% boost in score. So like I said, 110% is the highest, so 110% boost in score, which is technically very good but it's only meant for short duration songs um, but of course it doesn't mean you cannot use it in long duration songs um, you just have to spread out your skills activations uh, throughout the whole duration of the, the song well enough so you might need a variety of skills from episode plates like um, those that activate earlier because they are short duration then of course there are those that activate in the middle portions of the songs then of course you have the repeat um, skill effects for long durations that activates continuously throughout the whole song uh, after a certain amount of time. So yeah, as long as you plan your episode plays well enough and fully utilize the skills activation uh, periods, you should get a pretty good score. Um, taking a look at the last page, um, sadly to say, just like Ray Ray's episode plate, it doesn't come with any special notes attached to it, which is kind of a bummer. So is this plate actually worth pulling out. Technically, it's okay. Um, usually what I would say is, if you don't have an episode plate with such live skills, it's always good to have one in your arsenal or your collection, especially if they are in that, you know, style type of episode plate. You know, blue, yellow, pink, the usual three colors. Um, if you don't have that color, it's always good to have one on hand. So, yeah, why not try pulling the gacha? And of course, for Makina fans, I don't have to tell you, you just have to pull your waifu's episode plate because this episode plate looks lovely. <laughs> Alright, so if you're wondering why I know that My Friends is actually a long duration song, well, technically it's because of the um, Red Boss exclusive episode plate. Um, so many of you guys who are long time players would have already probably exchanged the episode plate from the Chaos Exchange tab. Um, if you can take a look here. Yep, so this is the exclusive Red Boss episode plate from uh, my friends. As you can tell, it can only activate its live skill during the use of this, um, or rather the play for this song. Um, then of course you can see that the ability for the live skill is a long duration one. So hence, yes, my friends is technically a long duration song. So like I mentioned earlier during the Maki Maki um, episode plate breakdown, it's not necessary a must to have every single episode played in your diva setup as a long duration setup. Um, but yeah, you know, it'll be ideal, especially since you're trying to utilize the long duration skill improvement episode plates, you know, if you have them in your arsenal. Alright, so let's do the usual. Let's pull out the single free pool first. I do have a few Super Dimension tickets to utilize before they expire, so uh, sit back, relax, and enjoy the gacha pool portion. Alright, here we go. Let's see whether we have the luck for today. We did pull out double copies for Ray Ray's episode plates, so... I don't know. Luck might not be there, but, you know, one can hope to get them Maki Ray pairing. <laughs> Ooh, 
Straight away we get costume points for the brand new costume, which is fantastic. Alright, so the basic requirement is done, technically. I can don't have to pull this banner anymore, but you know, I would like to at least give it a try to attain at least a single copy of Maki Maki's uh, episode plate. So, alright, let's move on with the free daily pool. This one is the afternoon session because, you know, the server resets at 12 noon in Japan for this event and gacha. Alright. So, it seems like we're not getting any Valkyrie animations. I'm gonna go ahead and skip this. Um, oh, it's a pretty rare plate too. So, it seems like the luck is there. It's just, it needs some help to push it out. <laughs> so let's do the Super Dimension Pool first. Um, so my ticket that will expire soon is like the end of the month, so technically I don't really have to use it, but um, should I? Uh, nah, let's let's save it. You know, uh, it would be better to keep the luck flowing um, towards the brand new 7 star featured gachas, I guess. So let's do the uh, template discounted pool and probably end it here if you know things go well. <laughs> oh no, there's no Valkyrie animations at all. Oh dear. Uh, at least we already done the bare minimum. Okay, so three Valkyries. That's pretty mediocre. Oh no, no red boxes on the first blink. All right, two red boxes. That's fine. No evolution on the first one. At least we're getting some Milane love. And Guvava doesn't look too happy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright, more points for the costume unlock. Oh, lots of points now. That's not too bad. Okay. So yeah, it's definitely not a must to attain the featured plate. Oh, Papa Max is here. Okay, looking young, unlike his... Uh, Delta movie version. <laughs> uh, Milane doesn't look too happy with her mom. Alright, so, okay. So, like I said, the bare minimum has been met. Um, so, as usual, guys, thank you guys for joining me on another episode of Utame Cross Gacha videos, especially for all of you who are new to the channel. Thank you guys so much for following and watching through the content, leaving likes and commenting down below in some of the videos. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm glad that some of you actually have asked me on Instagram as well, you know, certain things that you want to find out about the game. Um, so yeah, make sure you guys follow me on all the social media accounts that I currently have. Um, YouTube is being the biggest one and of course Instagram right now. Um, sadly to say, Twitch is kind of active right now because I don't really have the time to stream but eventually I will get back to it someday. Um, so yeah, thank you guys as always. Do the, the wonderful stuff before you guys leave the video like share subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video soon bye